<sighs> welcome back to the channel, welcome back to the vlog. And this has been us for the last two weeks. It's been fun. But that's all about to change. up in the house for the last two weeks pretty yep. much went away on holiday with some family had a, a great time and then came back because mr. over here um, decided to pick up COVID we think there is no conclusive evidence of a positive test that proves I had COVID it had to have been COVID because where did <coughs> I get mine from oh, something like seven billion other people in the world <laughs> And we assume it was COVID and then he started getting better and me, I was the peanut that got sick too after that. The beach is busy. It's hectically busy. I did not think there were going to be so many people here today. made it to Big Bay and how gorgeous is all of this? I mean like there's the best view though but yes we need a little, 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 little we need a little bit of vitamin C vitamin C you mean vitamin D vitamin C C C don't no, 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 no worry she, she's 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 on me she's 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 a little slow but shh, don't don't tell her <laughs> but uh, we did not realize that the beach was going to be this busy because of course we thought that we'd come here and the beach would be like completely totally ours. We're the only people that live in Cape Town, right? I mean, but that water's cold. That... It's shall, not shall, that shall, cold. shall I throw you in? No. <laughs> <laughs> and I think this is officially our first video, recorded video for 2022, not our first on the channel. So happy new year to all of you out there and thank you for the subs and for the likes and for the comments up until now. And please don't forget to smash that subscribe button while you're here if you're new. And uh, thanks for dealing with us crazies. Not us crazies, I'm the only crazy you. one here. <laughs> <laughs> but yes, this is Cape Town in the middle of summer where it is now almost, well, seven o'clock on the dot and people are still out enjoying the beach. It doesn't get much beautiful than this. And I don't know when else we've actually had such nice weather that like, it's actually pleasant at the beach. Like the wind's not too much. The wind, it's always the wind. Okay. And today we've got a little bit of a breeze just to cool us down. We have had a massive heat wave in Cape Town over the last two weeks with some days reaching 44, 45 there by us. It's been unreal. And for all of our international viewers, no, we don't have central air conditioning and heating like what you guys have. So we just have a good old fan. It's been torture. <laughs> and cold showers, but check this view out. And check out that sunset. So, yeah, we can barely. So we managed to stop and get some uh, Caribbean, Caribbean, Caribbean marker. There we go from our BMB, <laughs> from Mug and Bean. It's one of our favorites. And I can't actually see where I'm going yet because the sun is so bright. But we are heading our way to Signal Hill so that we can go and watch the sunset from there. We're taking you guys with us. But I just had to show you that view. Epic Table Mountain on the one side. And here we are coming up again for it. Table Mountain on the left. Lion's head on the right. I'm gonna miss not living in Cape Town. I mean, don't get me wrong, I'm excited for our next adventure when it happens, eventually. More about that later, but for now, living it up large in Cape Town. And out of nowhere, we've got somebody paragliding off there. I don't know if you're gonna be able to see it in here, but how epic. So, we've made it to Lion's Head, Table Mountain in the background. Some dude crazy enough to be paragliding. I think that's what you call paragliding off there. But how beautiful is that mountain? Well, this is unfortunate. We've hit the morning traffic going up to the top of Signal Hill. But at least from here, we can see somewhat of the sunset. And this guy's going to reverse and I don't know where he's going to go. But we'll enjoy the view. 
and they like a little bit of four by four. Yo, bro. <laughs> what? Still got plenty of space. Did you hear the beeper going off? Just one beep. Yo, now I think it's going to keep this side, eh? That side wasn't so. It's okay. We drive a four by four. Yes. <laughs> boys and girls this is about the closest we're gonna to get to the sunset there's Lindy trekking through the bush there's the full moon up there that you can't see there's the sunset behind us and we decided with that nine o'clock traffic over there we're never gonna get there in time and there we are sun setting lion set and unfortunately you can't make it up but there's a bunch of paragliders all around the top there a little bit windy for you Champagne's a little bit cold, so we're gonna just wait, enjoy the sunset, wait for it to come down. We'll get the moon when it goes up again, and then there's something I want to show you on Lion's Head when it gets dark. But stick around, don't run anywhere just yet. So, this here isn't the view that I wanted to show you, but how awesome is that? Moon up there, ocean, ship, city center down here, how beautiful! But up there, Lion's Head, that's what I wanted to show you. All those little lights. Are all little humans that are hiking up and down the mountain. It's an awesome thing you have to do on a full moon, but that's where we're going to end off the vlog. This view is gorgeous, isn't it? If you've made it this far, thank you so much. Make sure that you hit that subscribe button, the like button, share it with your family and friends, and um, we hope to see you in the next one. Until next time. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> and we thought we were done with traffic for tonight. Apparently not. Here's all the traffic. Note to self, next time don't come to Lion's Head on a full moon.